Hey guys! So now that the sun is kind of behind a cloud, we have nice lighting. Thank you, sun. I appreciate the glow that you were giving me, but thank you. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I have for you guys a gym shark haul. I'm super excited. This video is not sponsored. I wish it was, girl. I wish it was. So I asked you guys on Instagram if you guys wanted to see a review slash haul slash try on, and you guys said, Yes, obviously. Before some of you guys say, Harpreet, why are you doing this review? There's so many reviews out there. Listen. Listen. They want there to be more um, types of body types on YouTube versus like with, especially with gym clothing because I notice that whenever I look up reviews for gym shark clothing, it's always like the super fit, tall, skinny girls that Obviously, they look amazing, and I'm not hating on them at all. I'm just trying to point out the fact that whenever I look up for Gymshark reviews, it's always, like, the super athletic girls. There's never, like, someone who's, like, shorter or, like, not as fit, a.k.a. this gal. When you're looking for sizing, like, I don't know about you guys, but I go straight to, like, YouTube to see if there's any reviews and someone with my similar body type before I place an order. So that way I kind of know what size ranges were for me, especially because sometimes this uh, sizing chart is terrible. Someone that you guys can, you know, some of the girls out there that might be a little bit on the thick side <laughs> with three C's. You know what I'm saying, girl? That might be able to be like, you know what? She has my body type. This is what I should order and what I shouldn't order. Um, maybe this will help someone out. Maybe it won't. But regardless, I just wanted to put this on the internet. Um, I will probably leave all my like measurements and stuff in the description box. And I'll let you guys know what sizes I ordered and stuff. So I ordered two of the new released high-waisted leggings and just two tops that I figured would be cute for the gym and I didn't order any uh, sports bras just because I pretty much knew they wouldn't support support my chichis so there's no point in you know trying maybe as I lose more weight and they get smaller I might get a shot they're just super cute and like dainty they're meant for girls with like small boobs or girls that have like nice boobs you know the ones that are done I wish mine were like done but you know it is what it is I'm gonna show you guys what I got so Let's just pull all this stuff out of here, shall we? Sun, don't go back, go back. Go back under the clouds, sun. So the sun is back. <laughs> it's fine, we're still gonna do this. So, can we just take a moment to really appreciate Gymshark's individual packing? Like, look at how cute this is. I love this. I'm such a sucker for packaging, honestly. Like, I spend. A lot of my money because I buy into packaging. <laughs> you gotta package things cute so it's like, oh girl, I need them. So let me open them up and show you guys what they look like. <laughs> Please ignore that mess back there. It's not cute. With the top. First top I saw is in a large and it is the Vital Seamless Long Sleeve Crop Dusk in the color Dusky Pink Marl. Okay? Look at my skin tone and look at this color. Look at my skin tone and look at this color. So right off the bat, the only thing I'm not sure is that it's really cropped. And like, I have big boobs. So I just don't know if it'll be enough to, for it to go over. But we'll find out in the try-on part of it. Um, it's really soft. I really like these little air holes it has. But this is what it looks like. Super cute. I really love the fabric. It's really, really stretchy, you guys, look. So I don't think I'll have a problem fitting into it. The only problem is I just don't know if it'll be cute on me. Next top we have is the Vital Seamless Long Sleeve in the colors uh, Steel Blue Marl in a size medium. <sighs> I really hope this is not too small. I was really debating if I should order a large in this, and I got a medium, and now I don't know if I, that was a good decision or not. So this is the blue top. Right off the bat, I feel like this might be too small on me, you guys. Like, look at look at that. Like, who is going to fit in this? Not me. I ain't going to fit in this. But let's not be negative here. This is pretty stretchy, so maybe I can squeeze my fat ass in this. Um, same material as this one. I feel like I feel like this might be a little bit... No, it feels the same. I thought this one was a little bit softer. But same thing, long sleeve, and it's got the little 
thumb holes. Next we have the Gymshark. Why do I keep saying Gymshark? Like we know this is a Gymshark haul. Shut the fuck up. Next I have the Flex High Waisted Legging in Charcoal Marl and Dusky Pink. Which is why I got that crop top because matching. So, oh, lovely. Okay. So, okay. So I got these in a medium, you guys. I really hope it fits. It is stretched. There's a lot of give. But look how cute that is. Look at that. Look at that. Really love this new, um, how they did their branding for this. Like the logo is right on the back in this pink. And I think it'll be super cute with this together if this fits me. <laughs> um, and yeah, I hope it fits. It's a really nice thick material. I'll let you guys know if it's squat proof or not when I try it on, but I just hope I can even get it on. So The last pair of leggings I have are the same leggings but in black and charcoal. I love the color black, so I had to get black ones. And this is what they look like too. I really, really love this part. That was kind of like, aside from the high-waisted, this was the other thing that got me. <laughs> it was like, this is way cute. Then like the band that says Gymshark all around it. I just like that it just says it right here. It looks like a lot more clean and professional, I think. So same size. Just a little worried if it might not fit me. But I'm going to go put these on right now and show you guys how they look. So <laughs> I'll be right back. Okay, guys. So I got on <laughs> the top and the bottom. Um, So... I wish I would have had my mirror right there, but let's see. Yes, <laughs> the curls are big. So the top is really cute. The only thing I have to say about the top is that, like I told you guys, I have bigger boost. I feel like I have to keep pulling it down because I don't want it to like go past like this because then you'll be able to see my boobs. like the color of this. Um, the sleeves are a bit long, but I do have pretty short arms then it kind of like cinches not cinches but kind of like ruffles up is that a word i don't know what the word is but kind of like you know piles up right here and in my like arm right here it's kind of just like a lot of material same on this side like i pull it back all the way into my arm the thumb holes there's just a lot of material that kind of just like chills right here obviously i don't have those long arms so it's not really like a huge issue to me, I'm, um, but overall the shirt fits pretty good. It's pretty like tight, which is good because it's supposed to be like, this is the large, I'm really nervous about the medium. It might not fit me, but I really like the color. It looks really great with my skin tone. Um, I just don't know if I'll keep it in the crop. I might end up wearing the full length and not the crop. Material is very smooth. I really love how they made the logo right here. That's really cute. That's like one of my favorite parts. I also really love the detail on this. I just wish I had a flat belly <laughs> so I can wear it without looking like a fan ass. So that's that. Let me show you guys the leggings. Please do not judge me for my belly. I know it's there. I'm working on it. So I lower the camera down so you guys can see these seamless leggings. Um, I don't have a long torso, so therefore they are, I mean they're high, they're extra extra high because my torso is very short. <laughs> short girl problems, like if you know what I'm talking about, not their fault, it's me as a person. I'm very tiny, so, um, and I have back fat that I need to get rid of, so basically because of that, it pushes this, it pushes this down. So the logo doesn't even really show. See? So now you can kind of see it. So that's cool. This part is not like right underneath my butt like it should be. I'm scared to pull it up because I'm scared I'm going to rip it. But overall, I think the leggings are really cute. Maybe I need to size up. I really don't want to. Just I just wanted you guys to be able to see how they look in full body so i just went ahead and took my camera off the tripod so you guys can see so here's the issue with me since i have a big pooch right here right now because it's not flat as it used to be um it's really like digging in right here and it's making this 
stick out, which is not cute. Um, see how this part, the line is supposed to be like way up here because it's supposed to be like right under your butt. It's really not, but I think that's also because I'm not a tall person. I think if I was a bit taller, this would be exactly where it needs to be. But since I'm a lot shorter, it just did not do that. Overall, the leggings are really comfortable. If I was going to recommend them to somebody, I probably would. But if you're on the shorter side, then that's kind of up to you at that point. Uh, like I said, my main issue is that it just really digs into my love handles and accentuates them a lot more than it needs to. Now I know why I don't have clothing hauls. It's so hard to like get out of clothes and put them back on. Jesus. Okay, so this is the Vital Seamless long sleeve shirt basically like the pink one but not cropped and um just a different color so this is a really cute color as well right off the bat i will tell you i was right when i told you guys that this one was gonna be on the tighter side because guess what girl it's hella tight i mean still like breathable but it's definitely tight in the pits okay so it's tight right here but like it's still enough where I can work out but I know I would get really bothered by this part right here. It's like not sitting well in my armpits. Let me move this down. So lengthwise, this is a pretty long shirt. See? But I'd probably wear it like this because I don't like shirts that go past like my hip area. I think they look really weird. So. They have like this one where the girl kind of has it tied up, so you could totally wear it like that. I look very like professional, like I'm here to lift some weights, dog type shit. But the sleeves are kind of long, just like the pink one that I tried on earlier. But overall, I really do like the color of this. Oh, I wish I would have. I don't know what I was thinking trying to order a medium. Like, who do I think I am? I'm definitely a long sleeve kind of gal, anyways. I just like how. It keeps everything compressed. I'm definitely gonna send it back and order in the large. And then for that crop top, I'm probably gonna get it in the full size like this one, just cause I really do like the color of that and I would like it not cropped. So um, yeah, so that's the top. Let me show you guys the bottoms. So here are the leggings in black. Let me tell you, I actually really like the black ones. I don't know if it's cause they're all black and you guys know I love my black, but I do like all black ones. They don't accentuate my little pouch here, which is nice. Um, it kind of just makes it look like it's not really there versus that one since it was gray. But this is how the leggings look. Um, I think they actually look really, really nice. The fit is obviously the same as those. Contour on this leggings the same as the other one. It kind of hits me right here and my butt's right here. So this needs to be a little bit higher up. Um, I'm just scared to tug on it too much because because I don't want this mesh part to like rip. I like how it makes my booty look. It does kind of give it a nice little pop pop. Same on the bottom as well. It does like scrunch up right here. But the leggings are definitely like thick and super movable. Let's do a squat test. Okay. So I'll let you guys know when I watch this footage if it's squat proof or not. The mesh on this part is a little see-through but it's like super cute it's like breathable i really like the material on this it's really really nice it tends to like fold down and i just don't know how i feel about that because i really wanted to kind of be like gym shot i think it also depends on high how high i take it that the higher i pull them up the more it's gonna like roll over so if I only pull it up like there, it's not too bad, I guess. But it definitely does, like right here in this part of it. It really like, just really cinches in. I get that it's supposed to do that because it's supposed to make your waist look really small. But it just sucks because I feel like because of that, it really accentuates this right here on my sides. So that kind of sucks. Leggings are really nice. Um, they're definitely worth the coins. But uh, if you're a shorter girl like me, this kind of situation might happen um if you're okay with that then that's great but if it bothers you then it might not be the best choice one it does scrunch up at the bottom which is not an issue for me but if you're shorter like me and that's something that bothers you maybe just wait until they do like a cropped release of a pair like these that's probably something that would fit me a lot better 
Um, I hope that Gymshark decides to release a cropped version of these because I feel like for shorter girls, they would definitely fit a lot better. Um, the fit of these is really great. I really love how these fit my body. It really makes my booty look good. Um, and this is the top. I definitely need a large on this top just because it's super, super fitted and um, very tight on me, actually. This is a medium. I should have got a large. <laughs> Your girl thought she was a medium. Okay, so, so, what are my thoughts now that I've tried on the clothes? Um, I think that definitely... If you're a similar body type to me, you got big boobs, big thighs, and a big butt, um, and maybe a little bit of a not so flat stomach, definitely size up. Um, I'll leave my measurement, measurements for you guys down below so if you guys want to see for the same size and or correctly, definitely do it. If you do like the crop top version of it and you liked how it looks on me, I got it in a size large and I think it fit me really well. Aside from the sleeve issue, if you have short arms, that's just going to be kind of a given. Another thing that I also noticed is that I normally don't like um, thumb holes, but I really actually like how these feel. They don't feel uncomfortable. They actually look really like sporty, which is obviously the point of this, but it just makes me feel like really professional and like super cute. All the material um, was great of this shirt. It's like compressing, but just if it was a one size bigger, I think I would be more comfortable in it considering how much you're dropping on these. So it's definitely worth the coins. Um, just order right, basically. So like I said, this was a large and this was a medium. Definitely go with a large if you have a similar body top to mine. As for the leggings, um, I think the leggings are super cute. I honestly wish they would have fit me better. Um, on the material, I definitely give it a I'm gonna say a 9 out of 10 just because they're not as soft as I'm used to like the Nike leggings the Nike leggings are usually really really like soft they're breathable like I don't even feel like I'm wearing leggings a lot of people describe these leggings as a second layer of skin I know that sounds really weird but that's definitely how I would describe it as well like you don't feel like you're wearing leggings considering that this is really tight around the waist they are not going anywhere so if you're gonna be running you be like doing cartwheels you're gonna dance in them you're gonna do what you're gonna do you're gonna twerk in them these will not slide down one of the issues i do have with leggings that i wear now from nike is that when i'm running or sprinting they tend to slide down i have to keep pulling them up so it's really nice that this is like a double lined cinched waist that really like just i think i definitely need to size up in these i'm probably gonna get a large um the medium Fits okay, but I think I want it to fit better. Since I am shorter, I'm 4'11". Uh, they tend to look kind of like cinch up and kind of like just sit. Just kind of just pile up on the bottom of my legs basically. They are pretty long. But if you're okay with that, then you can rock it sometimes. I don't roll up my Nike ones just because I'm okay with rocking like just, you know, sometimes it's not that bad. Like with the black ones, it's really not that bad, but you can totally roll them up if you wanted to. Same with these. It's it's high-waisted, but it's like almost too high-waisted for me considering they have a smart tool smaller torso and there's just a lot of extra material kind of just hanging out around my waist and also on like around my ankle area it's just a lot of material again a lot of the people that wear these leggings are obviously like five five and like taller super athletic people um and i'm not trying to discourage anybody from buying their stuff definitely do it which is why i did i just was waiting for something high-waisted and they finally came out with these Flex leggings, that's the ones I've been wanting. I'm gonna wait until they come out with a cropped version of these high waisted leggings. So that way, there won't be so much material towards the bottom. And even if I yank them up, they won't be too bad. So, yeah, I think that's my full review on Gymshark. Um, I hope I kind of hit up on everything. If you guys have any questions that I missed and I didn't cover, please ask me. I'm more than happy to answer this for you guys because I really want you guys to have the most um, information that you can possibly have regarding buying Gymshark clothing. I think Gymshark has definitely stepped up their game. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give your girl a thumbs up. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Support your girl. And um, don't forget to give me a follow on my social media, which I will link for you guys down in the description box. Have a beautiful, pretty, fantastic day. And I will talk to you guys soon. Alright, bye.